Okay. Okay. Now my audio should be better. I was just doing this video. I have my cable plugged in, which messes my audio up. So, let me start over. Most people think a fact is something that uh, will hold truth or hold weight or always be what it is. Which it is, but it's not in the sense that people think about it. It's not that a fact is something that that we should all be parading around because that's what is actually going on. No, no, not at all. Anyone can make up facts. Anyone can make up facts. And if you look at the words, uh, a lot of people now like to say facts, like F-A-X, which a lot of people don't realize that's you're saying a fax machine, F-A-X, fax machine. It's a piece of technology which is still heavily used in this day and age, even though it's antiquated because of what it does. It's heavily used in regulated industries and the governments. And it is uh, a fax machine, put a piece of paper in it, dial a number, and it will send an exact copy to whoever you called, but that's really what it's doing. <laughs> Connecting to another fax machine on the other end, in a specific tone, how it talks, it has a specific tone, and it connects to the other fax machine, and it gives an exact copy of that document. So, that's why it's still used, because you're getting the exact same thing. So you know because of how simple this technology is, it, it can't really be messed with. It's not digital, it's analog. So it's completely, how it works is uh, not how technology works nowadays. It's, it's, it's not something that you can hack like that. You can tap into the line, but that's about it. You, you ain't gonna be able to do a lot more of that. You, you can't go and start changing information on that. It's, it's, not, it's not digital. It doesn't transmit like, it, like digital stuff. Not like email, which that's what was supposed to replace it, but not at all. And it's never going to, because email has way too many pitfalls. Purposely. So, a fax machine is just something that is constantly spitting out facts. But all that is is a repetition of whatever you're being sent. Like, I can have a fax machine, I can post my number on the internet, anyone can send me whatever the fuck they want. I can't, I can't do anything to stop it if you have my fax number, my fax machine's fucked in. You send me whatever you want. And if, if I'm that fax machine, like if I see myself as that, then I, that's me believing everything, all these facts that I'm being told because I'm told it's a fact. Oh, this is a fact, this is a fact. Oh, okay. The fact is a fact. It, and it is, because the same thing, but it doesn't mean that it, that it's true. I don't even want to use that word, but I'm going to um, for the sake of this video. It, there's a difference, because truth you can see is something that you come to on your own. That word's just overused at this point. But it's something you come to on your own. It's something that you have a realization and a revelation through self-awareness, conscious thinking, and observation. And that's when you take a fact that someone told you and you don't believe it and, and you put it in your embodiment of how you operate in your philosophy and you take truth out of it because uh, people try to say say you have a uh, a car payment or a mortgage. You know, they're sending you bills every month. Except if people knew what they were looking at on these papers, because it's it's basically a fax because it's someone printing out exactly what is on their computer. Same concept in a way. And. If people knew what they were looking at, they could take out the information that they needed out there and they could actually go and do something completely else with that information because they're 
they're telling you this is a fact. Like, you have to do this. But you don't. Because it, the only reason people have to is because of a sense of belief in the system that you have been perpetrated to. And even the words, it's facts, F-A-C, or F-A-X, the full word is facsimile. Fax is short. That's, that's a short form of the word. Full word is facsimile. And and uh, the facsimile is two words, two Latin words. It's facsimile, which means to make similar. Similar, simile. Seminole. No, 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 no. <laughs> I wonder why they call them slaves. No. But, uh, the facts simile fact is to make, simile is to be similar. Or to be somewhat the same, in the same, in, in the same reflection. So, that's why facts, the two ways, F-A-C-T-S and F-A-X, that's why it has a T, that's why it has an X. Because they're both crossing, so you're taking the fact, what you made, you're taking what you made, the fact, the matter of fact, what you made, and you're crossing it into something else that is similar. So, like, you have your body, you have your shadow, it's the same thing, but it's just a different casting of it. Just in a different realm. It's in a different paradigm. Same thing though. That's why these words are spelled like that. Because it's just a crossing. They're not giving you the, what's on the other side though. Because you're on the other side. And they just want you to do exactly what they made. Because they made this system. And they say this is a fact. They say it's all fact. It's all fact. You have to do all of this. It's a fact. You have to pay your taxes. People believe that. People believe that all day. They don't have to. But they can make up their own truth. They can make up their own world. They can create their own governing body. But instead, they go right along with the facts that are handed out. People wipe their ass with them and, and wipe the crumbs off their mouth. <laughs> Uh, the other thing about the word facsimile, it's simile, smile. Something that makes you smile is because it, it touches you in a way that is it's similar to you. You have some kind of relationship with it. You have interest in it, which means you have a relationship with it in some way. There's some type of communication going back and forth. You're putting your energy into it. it makes you smile. It's similar to you. So if you were to see someone that looks exactly like you that you've never met, you'd be like, wow, dude, this is what it is. It's interesting. And it will make you smile. Why do you think the best comedians are the best comedians? Because they're making fun of their audience who is laughing their asses off. They're smiling constantly because they're smiling at their ignorance <laughs> that they're being told. People ain't paying attention. Instead, they just take in the information and regurgitate it back out. I'm trying to see if there's anywhere else I want to go with this. This is a very basic concept that I wanted to get across. I don't want to make this video too long. It's facts ain't what people think they are. They never were and never will be. You have to stay true to yourself. You have to be in your square. You have to be self uh, capacitative so that you can put your energy into a fact and figure out exactly what's going on there and how it works for you in your system and how you move through this world. 
but let's see what was in the comments here real quick. Hey, zigzag! <laughs> That's hilarious. That, uh, I can't remember how that song, I know exactly what you're talking about. I'm, I'm going to go listen to that and turn it off here. Um, that's it for this video, though. If everyone enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up. Like this video and, uh, subscribe so you can get this type of information delivered to you sometimes because YouTube, you know, they, they don't like to get my subscribers notifications all the time, but if you subscribe and turn the notification bell on, that's, that's the most you can do. And we'll see how it goes from there. Everyone have a wonderful day. It's early right now and we're just getting started. Go get some milk right now. Some raw milk. Get a pump on.